people think it's all about the pink being like the girl and and everything and 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 they have to wear a pink helmet or they have to wear a pink board or, or ride a pink board or have pink pads or you know wear a pink tutu or something like that it has nothing to do with that whatsoever pink you know when it when it came up was was really just a gender identifier you know you have everybody when they have a baby you know it's like oh do i buy pink or do i buy blue and you know that's kind of what it was i love that they're girly and they're into boy like boy sports you know what i mean because it just proves that it's not a boy sport anymore it can be girls boys i mean the girls are in tutu skating and they are girly skaters they're not really tomboys i mean and I think that's the best part about it. It's just showing you that cute, you know, just like anybody can do it. You really can. You don't have to be a boy. All right, Morgan, so what do you think about the pink helmet costumes? Mm -hmm. they're, they're pretty cool. Yeah? Why are they pretty cool? Well, I mean, they're sponsored by people, but some of them are better than me. Really? Do you think they're like really, really good? Yeah. Yeah. For like, for like that, for like that age, I bet they're they're really good. Yeah. <laughs> so, do you want to be like the pink helmet posse? Like, do you want to get that skating? Um. Well, I love skating, and I want to become a pro. So, basically, yes. I never thought it was a girl boy thing. I mean, the pink helmet posse thing kind of came up. By accident, I guess. It was a total accident. We were just kind of laughing at them because they all were chilling around the skate park, just you know, with their little pink helmets on. And it was, you know, more than anything, it was just about spending time together as a family. Because then we all go to the skate park, and we all, you know, some of us better than others skate. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, the whole idea was to be able to do things together, not having you know half the family sitting on the sidelines. Yeah, I mean, that's the whole goal behind it. It was the whole, we didn't come up with the name Pink Helmet Posse. That's what they started being called because they wore pink helmets. And our whole deal was like, hey, if we're kind of in the know and it's this hard for us to figure it out, like getting the right boards, the right sizes, the you know, getting them on decent trucks and wheels and where to take them skating and how to teach them just the basic things, like, and we're kind of in the know. We all skate, you know, we come from surfing, skateboarding backgrounds. And if we're having that much trouble with it, like your average person whose daughter wants to skate is gonna be that much more lost and it's gonna make it that much harder. So our goal with this is like, hey, come skate with us. Like, you know, and we're saying that because we want people to come skate with our kids. Like, yeah. we want them to have other girls that they can go skate with and they're not like, the only one there. It's like, hey, it's fun, come do it with them. It's awesome.